Good afternoon, and for today's video, I'll be showing you how to make slow cooker barbecue chicken, so let's get to it. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna need is about one to two pounds of chicken in your crock pot. Then you're gonna add your dry seasoning. A half teaspoon of garlic powder, a half teaspoon of onion powder, and then a teaspoon of salt and pepper. What I'm going to do is I'm gonna mix these in a bowl first, and I'm gonna sprinkle it over my chicken. Just sort of break down any clumps and get everything evenly distributed, and I'm just going to sprinkle it over the chicken. Like I said, you can always adjust it to your taste. I'm going to add half a cup of brown sugar. Once again, you just want to break it. So half a cup of brown sugar. You can always add a little less, a little more. You can also use honey, or you can use both the brown sugar and honey if you wanted a sweeter sauce. A half cup of apple cider vinegar. Then for the next ingredient, a can of tomato paste. You can add that to your measuring cup. Add some water to it. You're going to essentially mix your tomato and your water together in your measuring cup. Or you could use ketchup. I feel like the tomato paste gives it a little bit of a fresher taste. You can add more or less water depending on how much chicken you use. You can also add all these ingredients into the measuring cup first and mix them together and tally up to you. I'm actually going to add a little bit more water. I start with a half cup. I'm going to add a little bit more just to get some water in there. And I'm going to also make sure my chicken is submerged in it. Okay. With that done, I'm just gonna put the lid on it and cook it for on high for four hours. And we'll see when it's all done. And after it's done cooking, this is what it looked like, and just shred with your fork. And if you wanted to, you could cook for an additional half hour. And then when it's all done, this is what it looks like and then just serve with your favorite sides. I hope you enjoyed this recipe and until next time, stay well, bye!